all of us at home we throw our waste away and once it leaves our house to the garbage pickers or the garbage handlers and we forget about it we should be there should be a higher level of awareness on what waste we generate what is its value where it is going how it can be recycled into the in an environment friendly manner the whole philosophy around it is creating an awareness that for the community that garbage or waste is a resource uh, a lady from an ngo came out here when she heard about the book stall that we have out here and she collected a lot of books from here to give it to the lesser privileged people in nagaland so that she could help them read and learn i think this is just a small example of showing how how we all can just do one some small thing can like affect and have a bigger impact on someone need to reuse reduce and recycle and that's going to be the best for the planet this is uh, this is a first kind of initiative here at least here in pune there aren't any more but there are people who are coming over here to look at our example and try starting them up in their own areas one thing you said about the like uh, foreign countries being better at recycling i just read an article recently where uh, they actually send their they, they send their waste to third world countries they don't recycle yeah. themselves they send it to our countries and you know pollute our countries yeah, yeah. so it's not them doing any good work i just want <laughs> to add in that so it's always the poorer population that is going to bear the brunt and at least if we start off and as a developing country first of all if we show the world that we can do it it will be a good thing uh, we have tried to create the awareness by posting the weekly event on all our social media groups to take forward this philosophy of segregation and recycling for the future india i can now see our own project uh doing delivering for the community and for the environment and that has been my inspiration and motivation even if we're going to be going to mars in the future earth was a first home and as a as a home it is our responsibility uh, it's our responsibility to keep it clean and neat we don't know what might happen in the future if this is even a plausible thing and again uh, we can't transport everything out there so and plus mars is smaller than earth so it de definitely it won't be able to handle our population plus the animals and plants there's no so i think it's we have to take care of the place we, we were born in even in our textbooks we learn how waste is such a huge problem not only in our country but worldwide uh, but the children are not going to actually understand and actually put it uh, into action if they see their elders not doing the same so it is the older generations which need to take the first step and try and you know uh, mold the minds of the younger children and teach them what the right thing to do is it's mainly the people's mindsets that we need to change we're trying our hardest but um, i think uh, we need to have a much more stricter routine that the government has to enforce